Hi, Cancer. <laughs> it's Roxy. Cancer, I'm here to do a love reading for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. I hope you're well, Cancer. I hope you're staying safe during this epidemic crap we're dealing with. Two cards fell out during the pre-shuffle and I took them, okay? Now, uh, Cancer, if you want a personal reading with me, all my information is down in the description box below. Cancer, as you know, not every reading can resonate with every Cancer out there. So just take what makes sense and leave the rest. Okay? Alrighty then. So Cancer, first card that fell out is the Ace of Cups. Now the Ace of Cups is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This is your energy. So you want to offer love to somebody. And this is new love, right? You want a new beginning in love with somebody. Maybe you just met them. This is like puppy love too. Alright, this is like the sweet... I haven't found out you're the devil <laughs> kind of love. I'm just kidding. Yeah, you just want to offer your your love to someone or someone wants to offer their love to you. Yeah, you're hoping that the relationship comes to fruition. Three of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. You can be dealing with a fire sign. It doesn't have to be. You just want this uh, love to manifest into a relationship, basically. Okay? Huh. Oh, yeah, the sun, definitely. This is a sign of Leo, major arcana. The sun is abundance, prosperity, um, financial success, everything. The white picket fence, you know, fluffy spot. <laughs> the 2.5 kids. I mean, you want it all with this person, you know? Yeah. And you're hoping they're not a sneaky, deceptive bastard. <laughs> This is the Seven of Swords, Aquarius, the Gemini energy. You're just praying they're not lying to you and they're not being deceptive behind your back. Yeah, definitely not. You're, you're trying to have the strength. This is the side of Leo Major Arcana to get through to form this relationship because you definitely want this relationship with them. You're feeling kind of bound to this person. Eight of Swords, Aquarius, the Gemini, right? Or the person might be might feel bound to you, right? It could be. It, hopefully, it's not your karmic. God, I'm hoping not. <laughs> yeah. It, uh oh, it could be your karmic, or you could be dealing with a Scorpio. This is the Tower, Major Arcana. This is something that is not built on a stable foundation. You know, like a house built on stilts. <laughs> um, hopefully, it's not. This relationship won't come crumbling down once you formed it. Or maybe you just got to get a Scorpio out of your life. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You want to move to calmer waters with this person. Maybe you had an argument. It could be that too, you know? And you're just like, you just want to um, not be in that mode with them anymore. You just want to move to calmer waters. This is Six of Swords. Um, this is an air sign. You could be dealing with an air sign. It doesn't have to be. But you want to be on an even keel with this person. Yeah. And you made a judgment call. This is Major Arcana. This is like an awakening you had. Or awakening the person had. All right? And you just you just don't want them to hurt you. You just want love. Yeah, you just don't want them to stab you in your back. This is Three of Swords. You're praying that it don't bring you heartbreak, right? Because you have a lot. Of, you have love for this person. Okay. Yeah, and you could be dealing with an air sign for real, right? Or you just the person who you deal with could be feel scorned to you. Queen of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Maybe they're scorned from a different relationship, yeah. And they might feel, make they might make you feel scorned, King of Swords, Aquarius, Super Gemini. Or you have to use your logic where you're dealing with this person. I'm just hoping they're not a narcissist. Because I usually read this as a narc. Hopefully not. Yeah, Knight of Swords. You're like rushing into this person. You definitely, definitely want to give them your love. And you're just hoping and praying that they will reciprocate and that they won't curse you out or, you, or you'll curse them out. <laughs> you just want to have an amicable relationship without argumentation. That's all. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Please stay safe. Take care. Be well. I'm sending you love.
peace, blessings, and kisses. Mwah! Cancer. See you next time. Bye!